Natasha, I need you to get Amanda out of here now. I'll buy you some time. You're crazy. It's the only option we have. Go, go. Go, now. Amanda. Manda, stay with me. Stay awake. Stay with me. Uh. Who's there? Who's there? Were you alone when they brought you here? There are others. How many? I don't know. Maybe six or seven. And where are they now? They're not here. How come? He took a liking on me. He said I was his favorite and that he was keeping me for his, his special clients. What you've been through can only be described as devastating. But it's now my job to protect you. You did the right thing by contacting us. He's an evil man. He will do bad things to me if you do not take me now. We keep fighting no matter the cost. What about you? What's your story? Uh, before I met you guys, I escaped from Italy, my home country. Infection rates were really high there. And I was one of the very lucky ones who managed to escape. Some people I knew weren't so lucky. I grabbed some weapons and some supplies and I left. I was a police officer. When I saw what was going on, it was like seeing something from a horror movie. I've never seen anything like it. So all I could possibly do was to save as many lives as possible. Again, some people weren't so lucky. After I shot Zachary, I put the gun down on the piano bench. And then I went into the kitchen and made myself a pitcher of lemonade. I made it just the way I like it, with loads of sugar and loads of lemon, and then I stirred it with my wooden spoon. I drank three glasses, one right after the other. They were large glasses, about this tall. And then my stomach kind of swallowed up. I guess what caused it was all that sour lemon. Mark the safe checkpoint on your map for you two to go to. You're not coming? I have to look for my brother and sister. I'm sorry. <laughs> 